the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And I to our channel or welcome to our channel if you are new and if you are new don't forget to check out our social medias which will always be linked down in the description box below and if you have seen our seen my face or my boyfriend's face before then that means that you probably already liked and subscribed i would hope um today's video is just going to be a vlog we haven't got to vlog for a little while and we've just been doing a lot of sit down videos so i figured that i would vlog and i would take you guys with me so right now um it's like 10 o'clock in the morning it's a saturday i'm not sure exactly when you guys are going to be seeing this but it is a saturday and austin is at um basketball practice he coaches seventh graders which i think you guys would know by now and i am just waiting on him to get home i am hoping that maybe he'll bring breakfast home because I joked with him and said that he should. And I know that I have a couple things to do. I want to clean the car. I want to run to Kroger to grab a couple things. Um, I have to go get blood drawn. So hopefully he hurries up because I'm not sure how long the lab is actually open for because like I said, it is a Saturday and I think we're gonna hang around the house. I go to work soon. I go to work at one and yeah. So today's video is just going to be a little bit of a vlog, follow us around. We also have to go get a copy of a key made because Austin lost one of his apartment keys. So we have to go do that. And yeah, so I think that's really going to be all that today's video is about. So right now I'm actually about to go in there and do some laundry. I don't know if you can hear the washer going behind me, but I'm about to go in there and do some laundry and clean up. So I will see you guys whenever Austin gets home.
Okay, so it has been a, like an hour later since the last clip after I folded my laundry. I put it away and then I waited on him to get home and then we went to go get my blood drawn and my doctor didn't send orders over, yay! So I couldn't actually get my blood drawn today and that sun is horrible, holy crap. I don't even know if you guys are gonna be able to see. Um, so I couldn't get my blood drawn and then we were hungry and we realized that breakfast was already over. So I got Taco Bell. I got Wendy's. And he got Wendy's, so yeah. Uh, I just got the nacho box. Cause I saw this in one of our mukbangs. Or like our top 10 things, that just looks so good. And then I got a taco too. And a Pepsi because the Baja Blast machine was down. Again, for the 15th time in the past two weeks. I don't think they fixed it. Probably not. Yeah. But we are about to just... I got a bunch of stuff. You got what? I got a bunch of stuff. Well, spicy you... nugs, spicy chicken sandwich, large fry. And Dr. Pepper. And I don't really like good. Dr. Pepper. I love Dr. Pepper. Mm, these fries are so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Lazy. I just got mild sauce all over my whole pant leg. Yay. Can you grab it on my hand, girl? Yes, my dog is back there too. He's not just talking to himself. Oh yeah, she's <laughs> in the back seat. Uh, I'm tired. Tacos was rough this morning. The kids were a little rough at the start, but they picked it up. I haven't done much all morning. Picked up a little bit. After I folded that laundry, I we're in the sweeper in the living room. And that's about it. Alright. Let's go getting long. And boy. So. We'll see you inside Dollar Tree. Okay guys, so we made it back home and um, I don't know last time we had the camera. Oh, uh, we ate. We were eating and then I said that I was, oh yeah, wow, bad view. Are you guys gonna fall? Nope. Um, then I went to Dollar Tree, so I'm just gonna do like a little Dollar Tree mini Christmas haul, I guess, and I know, still blurry. Okay, so oh, first, thing, the background. first thing I got are this placemat. It's literally so cute, I don't know. Like I said, Dollar Tree, everything's a dollar. So I got two because we have a two-person table. I got those. I got this little Christmas tree because I saw the DIY on Facebook where, like, you take the... What's that called? The ring. Like, you take the ring out and then I... You make something out of it. So I got that. Um, I got this cute little sign. Lacey's going to help you says seasons or merry christmas that's cute i like that no we're not decorating for christmas yet either but it's yes. broken we don't even have our christmas tote Look, here yet it's broken okay um the next three things that i got are actually for my work i take care of my patients and we are going to make some jello so i got these little jello things oh so cute and then she loves to paint, so I got her some things to paint for Christmas. So. Does she paint? Yes. I am going to be taking those to work. Next thing I got was just some ribbon. I got this one with the little red truck. For that, right? And this. Yes. Um, Take on girl. That, I got this red bow. I'm not sure exactly what we're gonna do, like maybe hanging on the stairs or on our TV stand. You no, know you could do. It just all depends on what we get when we actually go like Christmas tree shopping. Next two things I got, they're just lights. Uh, these are my favorite lights that come from the Dollar Tree. They are battery operated and they're just fairy lights. I love these. I have a lot. Um, 
I don't know why, but I really like the whole gingerbread thing this year. So I got this little thing. My sis just got her toy. I got this little gingerbread thing and you put a little tea candle right there and it lights up. So. That's cute. I like that. Like that. And then this is one of my favorites because on our Christmas tree, I'm going to get a picture of Landon and put him inside the gingerbread man and hang it on my Christmas tree. Cause it's so cute. If you can hear my cat's crying, I'm sorry. Um, next two things I got are just these stickers. I love these things. Um, actually you can like, these aren't even necessarily just for the windows or the doors. You can put these on like your stove, your doors, your windows, like all that good stuff. So just got some of those. I also watched another DIY that really interested me. I also watched another DIY that really interested me where you just get two of these candles right here and you put them in hot water and wait for the wax to completely melt. And then you pull the wick out and you dump the wax into like a Christmas jar or cup like this and put some peppermint oil drops down in it. And then it's like a peppermint candle. So, and then you can use these for something else. So I did get the stuff to try to make that, but obviously I'll do a video when I'm doing that. And I got these because I was gonna wear them when I was doing the haul, but I forgot that they were in there. Um, last things I got was, I was gonna go clean my car out, so I got an air freshener. But I didn't have time because I have to go to work. Then I got some holiday m and These are my favorite. Thumbnail. Oh, they're both upside down. I get candy from the Dollar Tree every week for my little candy jar. So, I just got some Butterfingers, M&M's, Twix, and Reese's. And that is my Dollar Tree haul. That is what I got from the Dollar Tree. So, yeah. um, next clip that you guys see is probably just going to be me putting our meal in the crock pot. So I will see you then. Okay, so for our homemade chicken and noodle recipe that we have, this is just a frozen chicken breast. Is that what this is? A skinless, boneless chicken breast that we have had in the freezer. And we're just taking it out and putting it right in the crock pot. These little bags right here are our saving graces. We love these things. They are crock pot bags so you just put it in and then when you're done you just take the whole bag out and throw it away and you only have to like rinse the crock pot out but we have that and then I'm going to take this chicken broth and I'm going to pour one whole thing of this in here And then I have two cans of Campbell's cream of chicken. So I'm just gonna open both of these up. We had chicken and noodles in my car. So I am just letting this, kind of like mixing it a little bit, not much. And then. I'm just taking a whole stick of butter. I'm taking the whole stick, not even cutting it or nothing and putting it right on top. And then I'm gonna go over here and grab some salt and pepper. Yeah, that's all. Found some chicken seasoning. There we go. Good amount of both of these. Just take this lid, put it on, 
and put it, I have it on high for four hours. So in four hours, hopefully the chicken will be done. We'll shred the chicken up, add these noodles in about half, about half an hour before we're ready to eat. And then we just like to put it over top of some instant mashed potatoes. So that is our easy crock pot recipe for chicken and noodles. And we make this a lot. We make this very often because it's just super easy to throw in a crock pot. Okay, so that's going to be the end of today's vlog. And we hope that you enjoyed it. Don't forget to, if you haven't already, to like this video and subscribe, turn on post notifications. And leave a peace with a peace sign in the comments to be shouted out in our next few videos. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.